Uh, okay, our gold only run has been going swimmingly. <laughs> Don't fuck it up. <laughs> Don't joke! No, Fraser! <laughs> Uh, if you joke, if this I make that joke, but there is, you know, that just tiny amount of RNG fucking you up. Welcome to ahead. Guess we need to find an alternative to game. Mm. Ah. It's not like Mario can jump or anything. Okay, hold on. Hold the fuck on. Okay, uh. like... Cannon? Like, you see the type of puzzle this is. If you shoot it the other way, I believe you get a treasure chest. But collecting the money is, you know, not bad, because more money means more... Um... You can buy more shit. I can't talk sometimes. We need to come over here anyway. So far, I'm enjoying this game, and it's... Random to have, you know, tactical fucking Mario where you have to start thinking about shit. We've had some of the best. Oh, so you have to hit the switch on it, like, I think backtrack to get to the one up there right now. Because now if you rotate that cannon that way. Then I think go up the bridge if Yeah, then go up and I believe use the cannon up there to get to it. No, because now the bridge is lying, so Yeah, that is exactly it. Yeah. This Brown plant. The plant boy! Oh, so this is what he was doing before Smash. And now that puts that there, so now we need to just circle around. We'll play a little bit longer. I wanted to get a decent chunk of this. I think the next mission might be the first boss. If not, there is one more mission before the boss. Right now we're doing pretty good. All things considered. Mm. Spooky. We're not there yet. Well, I think this is the area that that has the one thing. <laughs> when we get the healing, I will be using it, but... For now, I'm loving Sniper Luigi. <laughs> oh, it's... That laugh should make it obvious who it is. It's, it's Bowser Jr. Hmm. Who people always call Baby Bowser, and it bothers me. Didn't a Mario Party do that? That's why people do it, right? No. I swear there was a Mario Party that, like, fucked up uh, calling the- Oh like... shit, son. What are we dealing with now? It just looks like... Mm. Garden Hopper. Hopper. Okay, this mission has more hoppers in it, so we- God. Hopper. Yeah, it, like it has all hoppers because it's based on mobility. So because of that, see if you have any weapons that that doesn't have any. It doesn't deal any special damage, but it has a thirty percent. It's also a tiny bit. Yeah, it's a tiny bit stronger, and it has a good honey chance. And then you have same thing, but was bounce. Ziggy's Mario right now mostly has Ziggy weapons. Yeah. That deal is extra damage to Hopper. He was... Wait! 50% burn! And we're doing good with a 30% burn, but I feel like if we buy that, we're, like, not gonna burn at all. 
Do we? Was the other one a 50% bounce or was it 30%? 50% bounce. Jesus. Check them. For now, just with all the... With the hoppers. Luigi doesn't have anything. Does Rabid Peach have anything else? No. No. Yeah, okay, there's a the team we were using then, I guess. Mario. I, I'm liking these two. See if you can actually upgrade someone's skill tree now. Yeah, we got 20 ores, so. Excellent. God. We could put 20 into the healing. The thing, raise health points to all, yeah, all heroes in range. That's too good. Yes. So, ha, huh, I'm probably gonna put her back in the team then. Mm -hmm. And we'll have Luigi for sniping reasons. Yeah. But. Yeah. And for now, I'm leaving Mario on. The 30% honey or 30% bounce. We're not fighting um, Ziggy, so that bonus is kind of a waste. I'll go, honey. Okay. I think that's fair enough. Yeah. What? Yes. So you're going to want to get Luigi up, like, up there basically immediately. Okay. So I'm hot. He, uh, he appears to be one or two spaces short. <laughs> Thank you, RNG. <laughs> So now, yeah, now you can choose the ability. Though I, how do you choose? How are you swapping? Um, does the D-pad do anything? Oh no, yeah, I I'm done. I think it's the D-pad. No, it's not. Mm. Actually, the D-pad does work too. Mm. It's also the lower triggers. Mm. I'm not using it. Yeah. But so just either throw up her shield if you don't like her taking damage, or just leave it for now. So I actually uh, just have him run and get close to the pipe. One hundred percent to hit him. Might as well. Damage is damage. You know, I totally forgot there was a guy over here. Just leave the abilities for now. I just let you have it do them then. <laughs> yeah, that's. But Rabbit Peach actually has a lot of HP. I could do some shenanigans. Because yeah. I'm. Dash. Smack you. Go through the pipe. Into the pipe. Get close and shoot him. Hi, bitch. Bye, bitch. I, I'll. I think I'll save it. Yeah. On. Okay, so. You have to move a little. Would have... You'd have to, like, go through the pipe and hit him, I think, from the upper area. Dash. 
smash into him and then you might want to put regular Luigi on the full cover um over there We'll just do it in a weird order. Please. Kick him in the face. Yeah. That. Yeah. Just that. I'd save it. Yeah. That'll force. It forces him to move. Fifty percent. But if you hit, you take like all of his life. Want to get in closer and make the weapon weaker? But it is one hundred. No, that's why I was. No, I'm just seeing yeah, yeah, my yeah. options. And right now, the best option I can think of yeah, is 100 because is this? Yes. Oh, he can't move now. That's great. So because of that, actually, there are three enemies left on the map. So I'm not saying to use the like hero sight and stuff, but I am saying if you activate it, depending on where those three enemies are, it might actually help a bit. And then that would. Now, where are the other enemies on the map? Because that will kill him. Th that'll get... Now there are only two enemies left. Oh! Oh, it's, um... Enemies that are gonna sprout up around the beginning of the map. Yeah, but so I just would... have her right there, then. The tactical high ground. Yeah. Because that's gonna force... He's right there. And he... Yeah. And then there's no... Hmm. Um, okay. So, let's see. If you move through the... You can hit him right here, but you could also move through the pipe to get a clearer shot to hit, deal 100 damage. Well, I have 100% chance to hit him. But you are then in his line of fire. Also, you can dash through him. I keep forgetting that dashes don't wait. Why couldn't we have bounced there? Should I? There's no one in Mario's range. He's probably just going to shoot you and none of the other enemies are immediately in your range. Actually, you bring up a decent counterpoint a lot. Let me smack him. Actually, hold on. Best idea. Smack him. Get behind that jerk. Snipe the fuck out of that guy. He'll die. Now, Luigi. Uh, hold on. Did you use Rabbit Peach's move? No. She should be able to go down, like, no, you're, you're going to want to go back down the pipe. Because I think if you go down the pipe, you can dash through the one guy. Come on. Yeah, you can dash, and then shoot. Uh, we're going to hit him. There's nowhere to hide, so you'll kind of be forced to... Well, you, you could do that, but that would make it hard to shoot him. No! Actually, no, 100, so, yeah! <laughs> and then that thing will pop up. Smack him. And... Shoot him. Because you have 100. He has 100, so you you would probably want a barrier. As of just in case. I, I would just leave the, the hero sign and stuff for now. I'll give them a turn. 
Just so we can... Me and you are just gonna circle Terra aren't we? I believe the goal of this was kill five enemies. If you kill that guy right next to Rabbit Peach, everything should be okay and the mission should end. So just do that. Yeah, defeat five enemies to win. We just need to kill one more. If Rabbit Peach kills that guy, we're good. Or, wait, can Luigi snipe him from here? No, I'm just gonna stand stupid vulnerable. But, that should end. Yep. Five or six, yeah. Cause I'm fucking awesome! Awesome possum! What happened? Kick us out the machine on his butt. Hmm. Oh shit. Oh, the smashers. Oh shit. Shit. Rock. Ah. Oh. I'm going to ignore that for a minute and just. Okay, yeah, I couldn't get that treasure chest. Okay. Okay, good to know. I find it interesting how, like, the level design is, you know, directly where you find. It's not, it's not like you're just teleported into a nebulous space that are maps or any a thing. It is part of the level design. Oh god, the smashers. Is he gonna throw his jelly donut at us? No, he's gonna hit you, is it? <laughs> Smash! I feel the deal. Uh, the Donkey Kong's uh, Jungle DLC kind of has a fetish for these things. Anywho, back to this epic game. Yeah, Smasher. Pinheads in pursuit. Oh, to reach the area. It's time for the question of the day and my overall thoughts on the topic. So anyway, do you ever play a game like this and then realize in hindsight you maybe could have done one or two things better or differently? I asked because in that one mission near the end where we had to defeat five enemies, I thought about... If I had used Hero Sight, I think Luigi's sniping could have shot that one enemy near Rabid Peach, and we likely would have won the match a little bit easier without Rabid Peach taking damage. I think that would have actually allowed me to win just a tiny bit quicker. It wasn't the worst option to not do that but I was thinking about from the height because of the high ground bonus and how Luigi works I think he would have actually sniped that enemy and won but that's just my opinion on the matter when you're recording a YouTube video of a game like this sometimes when you go back over your own footage you stop and realize okay I was kind of being an idiot but anyway you can leave your thoughts, opinions, and answers in the comments, or you can leave them on social media. All my social media links, as well as my Discord link, are in the video description. Now, as always, I need to be a shill for a minute. If you subscribe to the channel, and if you follow me on social media, that really helps our communities grow. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. I will see you all next time, so good night, everybody.